सो दिस इज ए क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम मैंसुरेशन चैप्टर आज बाई यू पी एस सी इन सी सेट पेपर ऑफ टू थाउजेंड सेवेंटीन टू वर्ल्स एंड ए सीलिंग ऑफ ए रूम मीट एट ए राइट एंगल एट ए पॉइंट पी राइट सो देर आर टू वर्ल्स राइट सो सपोज देर आर टू वर्ल्स लाइक दिस राइट सो दिस इज ए रूम ओके सो ए फ्लाई इज इन द एयर वन सेंटीमीटर फ्रॉम वन वॉल Suppose the fly is here, right? So this distance is one centimeter, one meter from one wall, and eight, and this is eight from the other wall, and nine meter from the point P. So the point P is where they are meeting here. So from here, the distance of this point they have given. Right. So this is nine meter. How many meter is the fly from the ceiling? Right. So see here. ये थ्री डायमेंशनल का क्वेश्चन है तो थ्री डायमेंशनल में डिस्टेंस कैसे निकालते हैं वी हैव टू यूज दैट फॉर्मूला इन थ्री डायमेंशनल राइट सो इन थ्री डायमेंशनल फर्स्ट आई विल टेल यू व्हाट हैपेंस लाइक लाइक दिस राइट सो दिस इज एक्स एक्सिस दिस इज वाई एक्सिस एंड दिस इज जेड एक्सिस राइट एंड दिस इज द ऑरिजन ओके सो हेयर सपोज देर इज ए वन पॉइंट ओके देर इज ए वन पॉइंट हेयर ए सो द डिस्टेंस ऑफ पॉइंट ए फ्रॉम ओ ए राइट सो हाउ वी कैलकुलेटेड actually right so the formula is o a square is equal to or you can write o a is equal to square root of because this is three dimensional so here the point o will be represented by 0 0 and 0 because this is starting point for all three and this point a will be represented by x y z right so x representing <coughs> what on the x axis y the distance from the y axis and z the distance from the z axis right so this will become what this will become this will become x minus this 0 square plus y minus this 0 square plus z minus this 0 square don't consider zero here just consider x1 x2 uh, x1 y1 z1 right then it will look good right so this is x minus x1 y minus y1 z minus z right so this is the formula so we have to apply that formula only but here they are not giving this o point is in on the ceiling side right so here this is a floor what i am telling you but it will get reverse actually because they are saying that point is here okay this p point right so this floor is now ceiling but the concept is same okay so we will apply this formula only so they have already given the distance from this point p or this point o are you getting so here we consider oa and here they uh, gave this the distance from point p so this is what they have given this is 5 square 5 right they have given what they have given oh sorry this is 9 so they have given this distance is 9 so 9 is equal to same concept we will apply right so this point is zero actually here here i told you the formula right otherwise it's zero if it's initial point okay so this will become from the distance from the one wall the distance is 1 meter and the from second 8 meter right and from the third we have to find how many meter is the fly from the ceiling so this is the third dimension okay so now this x will be how much this x is 1 minus 0 because this point is as at the beginning this is 0 as we considered here at the origin point right so the dimension of this point will be 0 0 0 okay plus square we have to take now 8 minus 0 Square or this will be plus z. We don't know. Z is the ceiling, right? Z minus zero square. So what we can do? This will be eighty one, right? Is equal to one plus this will be sixty four plus z square, right? So this z square is equal to eighty one minus one minus sixty four, right? So when we will solve it, what we will get? We will get sixteen. So z is so z is 4 meter right so the answer of this question is option a okay so i hope uh, ye aapko samajh aa gaya hoga uh, i try to explain in a best best possible way right if you guys still have some issues so you can connect with us and i will explain you this question personally again